Let me say a few words concerning the problems young people have. Please remember everything that I told you. Take God's promises, claim them in Jesus' name. When you read a promise in the Bible, say, Lord, that's for me. One of the problems young people have is accepting yourself the way God made you. You can say, why am I not taller? Why am I so short like that person? Or why am I too tall? Or why am I a little fat or obese? I want to be thinner. But some people, are. our body is made like that. All are not the same size. You must learn to accept yourself the way God made you. You're not as intelligent as somebody. Never mind. That's the way God made you. First thing I'd say, learn to accept yourself as God made you. It will bring a great liberation in your life. The other problem a lot of young people have is conflict with their parents. Learn to respect your father and mother. It will go very well with you. The Bible says honor your father and mother and it will go well with you. I've seen that. I've seen young people who have honored their father and mother. It has gone well with them. Your parents have been given to you by God. They are not perfect. Nobody's perfect. And your parents are not perfect. You are not perfect. But don't get into conflict with them. If you have to disagree with your dad or mom, say it lovingly. Dad, uh, please, can you excuse me this? Don't, be, don't get into an argument. Another problem young people have is when they get into school, they find a lot of pressure from their fellow students to act like this and speak like this and to get into this type of friendship and certain habits. Be very careful. It's called peer pressure. Peer pressure means people in your school or your friends trying to force you to do something. Be very, very careful. Don't let them force you. Look at Jesus. Say, Lord, I want to be different. They may make fun of you. I remember in my younger days, a lot of people made fun of me. I said, okay, that's what made me strong. Another thing, a very strong thing that young people face is sexual temptation. To be tempted, the boy tempted with a girl or the girl tempted with a boy. Be extremely careful in this area, especially after you become 13, 14, 15, onwards all the way up to till you get married. You'll find this temptation coming in your mind, in your thoughts. And I'm not saying you cannot speak or be friendly with boys and girls. That's all fine. But don't let dirty thoughts come into your mind. Don't watch dirty movies. A lot of young people are watching that type of stuff. Is ruining their mind. It's like eating rubbish. We don't take garbage and put it into our mouth. But that's exactly what young people are doing when they watch filthy movies, putting garbage into their mind. How will, how will you, you'll get sick if you start eating garbage. And a lot of people are putting garbage into their mind with the movies they watch and pictures they see. Be very careful in this area. Avoid it. And one last thing that young people may face is disappointment, failure in life, failure in a school, or being treated unjustly in school or by somebody. Learn to overcome it. I want to say to you in conclusion, you must believe that Jesus can help you to be a conqueror in every situation. 